Travelers, thanks for joining me on another episode of Adventures in Welding. I'm Paul, and this is episode 100. That's right, we put down our 100th episode today, April 20, blah, 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 2015. You're right, I don't know what day it is. It's Saturday, does that help? Anyway, today we're going to go into part two of our introduction to spray transfer GMAW welding. All right, setting up for a spray transfer, we've got it set for 30 volts and about 500 inches per minute. Uh, that's a good setting for this machine. Your machine may vary. What you want to do is set your volts high and adjust your wire feed until you get the hiss. Transfer, you want a stick out of about three quarters of an inch. If you use the quarter inch stick out that we use for short circuit, you're not going to be happy with what happens next. That short stick out is going to weld your wire. All right, here we are testing on a piece of quarter inch. We got a nice hissing sound. Seems to be a smooth arc. Call that bueno. All right, finishing tacking up a plate here. This would be a 3 8 plate, uh, 70 degree V groove with backing. And here we go. You want to use a push with spray transfer. I've done it with a pull also, but they say you want to push. And I'm oscillating it just a little bit to spread the puddle out. Here's a close up look. As long as you're getting that good hissing sound, you're spraying just fine. Alright, here's the second pass, cover it up. And this is probably only going to take two or three passes to fill this entire V groove up. That's the beauty of spray transfer. Alright, let's switch over to the close up view. Here we are, we're in the close up view now, and you can see how just oscillating a little bit to spread that puddle up onto the bevel edges. Nice, smooth, hissing sound. Mucho bueno. Oh, sorry. I wasn't paying attention again. My bad. Anyway, there's the finished piece. Four beads for the cap, and if I put this wire on here, you can see there is some distortion. It looks like maybe about three eighths, but that's to be expected. And I think it's less than you're going to see with uh, SMAW or GTAW, simply because we were able to put the passes in there so bloody fast. Anyway, spray transfer is something to keep in mind, but the puddle is so fluid that you can only use it in. That you can only use it in the horizontal, I mean the flat and the horizontal welding positions. No good for um, 3G and no es bueno for overhead. Thanks for joining me on our 100th episode. And I'll see you again next time on Adventures in Welding. Subscribe already! Like, comment, share!